Humanoid robots raced against humans for the first time in a half marathon in China's Beijing on Saturday. The robots were accompanied by human trainers, who sometimes had to physically support the machines during the race. One of the robots fell over at the starting line and lay flat on the ground. Another crashed into a railing after running a short distance, causing its human operator to fall over. The winning robot, Tiangong Ultra, finished in 2 hours and 40 minutes. A long way to go before it can surpass the men's winner, who finished in an hour and two minutes. The race drew crowds of spectators, including Hersi Shu, who works in the field of artificial intelligence. There's a kind of sportsmanship, whether it's humans or robots. They are all exercising. It feels like I'm watching the development of machines, the development of AI. Although humanoid robots have made appearances at marathons in China over the past year, this was the first time they were competing alongside humans. The robots from Chinese manufacturers such as Droid UP and Noetics Robotics came in different shapes and sizes. Some were shorter than four feet, while some were nearly six feet tall. Beijing officials have described the event as more akin to a race car competition, given the need for engineering and navigation teams. China is hoping that investment in frontier industries like robotics can help create new engines of economic growth. Some analysts, though, question whether having robots enter marathons is a reliable indicator of their industrial potential.